Hi, you're with me backstage and I'm David Julian. London or Manchester? Oh well, it's got, it's got to be Manchester. I'm from here. Um, I've spent the last sort of two years um, in London working on uh, the West End for Thriller Live and uh, yeah, this is my first time coming back home and, and doing it on a different stage, which is great. But um, yeah, the city itself has got to be Manchester. What are my favourite flavoured crisps? Oh, I like a bit of everything, you know. I do like the standard cheese and onion. Um, but wasabi, there's a uh, sensations, wasabi and ginger. They're good. How do you look after your voice? Uh -huh. Well, this is quite, uh, it's quite apt because I'm actually, I'm just uh, recovering um, from laryngitis. Um, but to me, for, for me, I do lots of stretches because I do quite a, quite a high, quite impacted kind of show. Um, so I need to keep my voice stretched and, uh, and warm. Uh, so I tend to uh, yeah, sit on the train and kind of cover my mouth while I stick my tongue out as far as I can and uh, kind of just go down in scales and, and go as low as I can. If a zombie apocalypse happened, what would you do? Find the nearest pub, bar the windows and just wait for the whole thing to blow over. That's great, I love that film. What am I currently listening to? Uh, do you know what? I kind of like the um, Harry Styles' new album. What's the scariest thing I've done? The scariest thing I've done? It's probably being on national TV. <laughs> uh, when I went on The Voice, the scariest moment for that was the blind audition. Everything else was fine because I'd been on the, the stage after that, but the blind audition, you walk out and all you can hear is your footsteps. There's nothing else. The audience have got to be quiet because they can't give away who, who they're looking at or anything like that. So all you can hear is your own footsteps. Uh, and then you've just got to stand there and there's four of these mega famous people right in front of you on chairs that you can't see. Um, yeah, it's that probably the scariest thing I've done. 